planning a visit to Amsterdam? Check out our special videos for nightlife, family, budget, and sightseeing at vidtour.com to help you plan the perfect vacation. And check out the 10 places you have got to visit on your next vacation. At number 10, we suggest the Old City Center. Amsterdam has one of the largest historical centers in Europe. A great way to orientate yourself at the start of your stay is to take a walking tour. Amsterdam is very easy to get around. And every corner, every building has a story waiting to be brought to life by a knowledgeable insider. At number nine, we have the red light district. A word of warning, don't take pictures of the girls in the windows or one of them may grab your camera and throw it in the canal. Check vidtour.com for special videos on the world's first red light district or do one of the many tours where you can feel safe or even get a chance to talk to a real working girl. At number eight is the Behindhof. Leave the red light district behind for a slower pace of life. The Behindhof may not be as well known, but this beautiful religious courtyard and church is a hidden gem. Still fully occupied today, it is a little village all of its own, and it also contains Amsterdam's oldest house, an oasis of calm right in the heart of the city. At number seven, we have the Van Gogh Museum, one of the most popular art museums in the world. Van Gogh's style is unique and not to be missed. So if you don't want to spend most of your time standing in line, try to pre-book your ticket in advance or look for one of the city passes. Check our website for more information. And number six, Amsterdam's coffee shops. Sit back and relax while you indulge in Amsterdam's legal high. It can only say coffee shop over the door if it has a license to sell cannabis. But the Dutch are changing the laws and it may lead to tourists being banned. So when you're in town, check with the locals to keep up on the latest situation. At number five, we have Nemo. One for the kids. Nemo is a stunning building designed by superstar architect Renzo Piano to resemble the bow of a ship. It is an interactive science center that will keep children entertained for hours. They will smell, touch, hear, and see how the world works, while the parents can relax on its large rooftop sun terrace. At number four, we have the latest iconic building in Amsterdam, the Eye Film Institute. This eye-catching structure is on the north bank of the Ljubljana waterway just behind Central Station. Take one of the free ferries across to catch a movie or an exhibition, or just have a coffee and enjoy looking out at some of the very best views of Amsterdam. In number three, we have Heineken Experience, the home of Heineken beer. This heritage site is now an interactive experience where they show you how the world-famous beer came to be. An afternoon immersed in the world of Heineken will leave you thirsty for one of the free beers they offer at the end of the tour. At number two, we have a must-do for Amsterdam, the Anna Frank House. See where the Jewish girl Anna Frank hid from the Nazis during World War II. Here she wrote much of her world-famous diary. Her statue is also just around the corner. The queues are always long, so think ahead and buy a ticket online or use the Amsterdam card. And number one, we have another must-do. The famous canals of the Venice of the North. The city center includes more than 90 islands and 400 bridges. And the best way to explore them is by cruising the canals. There are many different tours, from a sightseeing tour to a candlelight dinner cruise, that show off this wonderful city in the way it was originally designed. Unforgettable. Looking for more tips about your vacation in Amsterdam? Visit our website 
vidtour.com for plenty of videos about nightlife, attractions, day tours, family attractions, and many more.